Steel production is remarkable because of how much we rely on steel as a consumer. With how often we use steel in construction, transportation, and everyday items, you would think that the steel making process would be simple. However, because steel doesn't appear natural, there is a complex chemical process to create the material. Most consumers may not realize it, but steel is not a natural recurring metal. Instead, steel is manufactured combination of various metals and natural materials. To create steel, you need iron ore, coal, and a crap steel. Some modern steel making metals use steel scraps to recycle and a feedback into the steel making process. This helps create stronger steels with a strong material makeup. Have you ever wondered how a beautiful car or your water heater is made? The answer starts in a steel manufacturing mills in which raw steel is transformed to usable products that are used by different industries and present us as a lot of useful products. In this video, we address one of the most popular types of steel coils that is used as in factories to give you a general idea about hot rolled coils. Rolling is a very popular term in a metal working world. It refers to a metal forming process in which a metal stock is passed between two rolls in order to reduce the thickness and get a uniform thickness. Rolling is in the initial process of a steel products manufacturing such as a structure of steel and the coils. Rolling mills can process steel quickly and convert semi-finished coasting products, including ingots, blooms, fillets or slabs into finishing products like beams, bars or coils, etc. Hot rolled steel is a steel that had rolled past a very high temperature, approximately more than a 2000 degree Fahrenheit, which is above the recyclation temperature for the most steel types. The heat gives a steel workable starting form and makes it easier to shape. Hot rolling starts with a large long steel called billet, which is a heated and sent to a large roll to flatten. Then it is passed in a series of rolls keeping its high temperature, until reaching to the final wanted dimensions. Then steel sheets are spun until coils are left to cool. For bars and a beam, steel is a sanction and cool. Hot rolling doesn't give precise dimensions since steel shrinks while cooling, so the resulting steel is suitable for applications where minutely specific dimensions are in crucial, like railroads and constructions. Hot rolling steel can be defined by these features due to the shrinking remnant of cooling. A scale surface, slightly rounded edges and corners are slight distortions. Advantages of hot rolling steel. Cost efficiency because it requires much less processing than the cold rolled steel. Feed from internal stress that arise while cooling since it is left to a cool at the room temperature. Ideal for application where ocular dimensions are not important as steel strength. Hot rolled coils. Hot rolled coils are one of the flat steel products. 
They are sheets of prime or second choice steel that are rolled in a hot steel mill into coils while they are very hot. These coils are very common types of steel coils that form the base product for other steel coils, like coated and galvanized coils and also used directly nearly in various industries and machinery, like construction, shield welding, auto car industry, etc. Hot rolled coils are a good choice when tie tolerances are not so important and when price is more important than a precision. They are a preference for steel companies and metal work due to their malleability and cost efficiency. Hot rolled coils have an appearance that distinguishes them over their old coil types. They are darker gray and have a silvery blue, almost purple strip along both sides make the steel surface appear as if it is still hot to the touch. The appearance makes hot rolled coils the most commonly used type of art sculptures.